Hero is my name is Kat, and guys, welcome back to Miss Cat Squad, the geeky and let's play talk show that's all about, you guys guessed it, geeky goodness and game. Guys, guys, guys. Today, I'm dressed as Barnacle Boy. From SpongeBob SquarePants. No, I'm kidding. Literally, I got this shirt, all right? This is story time right now before we start the actual video. I got this shirt, okay? And the first thing I'm, I'm wearing it, and I'm like, yay, awesome. It's so colorful and popping with colors. And my two sisters, when they see me in the shirt, they say, you look like your barnacle boy from SpongeBob SquarePants. And I'm like, you know what? SpongeBob Pride, that's right. I'm a fangirl. I'm not afraid to admit that. But hey, welcome back to Miss Get Squad. Today we're gonna be reacting to more Overwatch shorts. And this is the one you guys have been requesting for a while. And yeah, I'm kind of doing this out of order now, which is funny because I'm trying to see what you guys want me to react to more. And uh, yeah, there's a lot of fun coming up for Overwatch because you guys have been supporting it a lot. And yeah, this today we're doing um, Junker Town The Plan Overwatch. So who is this person? Junker Town, the plan. Is it- his name is Junkrat? What do you mean by Junkrat? I got a mouse here, which is Pikachu, but like Junkrat, like is he like in the garbage eating junk and is he part rat? But he looks human. I'm not sure, but I love the colors. Look at that, the yellow and the black and the orange. That is gorgeous for that thumbnail. 1010 would recommend those beautiful graphics. Look at this beautiful graphic. Let us describe how gorgeous it is. Overwatch, Blizzard Entertainment. Fist bump and round of applause for your graphic designer. It's awesome, my friends. But yeah, today we're gonna do more reactions to Overwatch because you guys have been supporting this like crazy and thank you so much for tuning in. I am loving the Overwatch series. Now because you wanna you wanna know why? You wanna know why? You wanna know a little secret! It's because these guys, these these characters, obviously feel so real. They feel so real to us, and it's not even funny. I, for one, love stories, okay, that have some kind of characters that you could literally be like, I am that character, you know? I, I can feel, like, a connection to them because of who they are. Blizzard Entertainment, you guys did perfection with this, because literally, how, like, you could meet any one of them, a tiny little one, t even, like, some of the characters don't, that don't have, like, a major short yet. You can meet them, and you could be friends with them, and honestly feel like you wanna, you actually wanna be friends with them and go to a cafe or something like that's how much I love this series because of the characters like yeah the game you guys might be saying you know it's toxic here and there when you play online but it's not even just about that you know it's it's about these characters and if we didn't have these characters there would be no game you know there would be no story it's because of these characters so I can't wait to meet my brand new my brand new my brand new, why do I keep saying that? My brand new Junkrat. I am just kind of scared to learn about who Junkrat is and why they are called Junkrat. So, let's get started, shall we? Let's get reacting. Dun, dun, dun. What's going on? They be shooting. Why, how did he? Junker down! Well, that's a fine how do you do. <laughs> what was it you think got us the boot? Stealing the Queen's cash? Cool. Blowing up her summer sack? You know, that's never a good idea. That's never a good bar? idea. <laughs> Whatever it was, you really ticked off the big boss this time. <laughs> I don't think they're gonna let us back in. No! Well, they just want to place the live and move. Well, his design, look at that. Money and explosives. <laughs> I've got an idea! Oh god! No. No, dude. Dude, this isn't a good- this is not gonna be a good idea. This is- Dude, you have one leg! Junkrat and, and Roadhog. Oh my god! <laughs> That's fantastic! Oh no. One world run high spree later. <laughs> I can't wait to see the look on the queen's face when she sees exactly who double-crossed her! <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna go over the plan one more time. Yeah. So you don't screw it all up! You're probably gonna be the one that screws it up. It's always the little guy. Right. First, we light the fuse! Woohoo! <laughs> Other way. Conspicuous disguises and sneak into town. <laughs> After that, we get our glorious It's gonna fail. It's gonna fail. I'm, I'm right sensitive. It's gonna to fail. Boss's place! Boss's place! Reveal our ingenious deception! <laughs> and move! They'll never see it coming! <laughs> <laughs> you are insane, my friend! Oh. He's gonna put some sense into his mind. Oh, right! <laughs> 
<laughs> we need an escape plan. Yeah, <laughs> dude. Gotta relate to this though. Reveal our deception. Run like hell and boom! Boom! It's foolproof. Ha! What? What did you forget this time? No point in blowing it up. So. Use trolley front door. Reveal. Front the door. Shut single bing. Boom. We good? I think I think we're good. I think we got this this time. Yes! I can relate to this, like how it is with planning things. His fast thinking mind. Oh no. You're, it's going to fail. Whatever you do, don't blow it. That's so cool. Inconspicuous. <laughs> Who oh. is it? Here we go. <laughs> Dude! Dude. <laughs> it's Joe Yes! <laughs> he sings the theme song! Okay, okay, lots to talk about this. Let's put the controller down and let's talk. Alright, first of all, I can kind of relate to Junkra because how my mind works, and it's called Junkertown the plan um how i come to planning certain things especially when it comes to miss cat squad i kind of rush into certain things like oh i want to do this now i want to do this now and i never actually think about the consequences and things sometimes end up going wrong within the team so with this it kind of i can relate to him and it's funny because how he's just moving around so fast how he's talking so fast how he's so loud that's me oh god i'm gonna end up loving him aren't i <laughs> But I, as you guys know, I love all the Overwatch characters, but like that was- this is comedy at its finest because at the end, he ends up humming the theme song in his quirky way by how he literally he ends up screwing up the plan and telling the big guy, oh, don't screw this up! Don't screw this up, you idiot! And then he's the one that ends up screwing it up? Yeah, can relate. Hi, my name's Kat and I can relate to Junkrat. <laughs> but this is great, this is great because it shows like- even though this one wasn't as long as the other shorts, this one was jam-packed with fun, and it got you got to learn about awesome two new characters who, you know, are quirky and fun. And you always have to have that, like, side of Overwatch, you know? You have to have that side where it's like, yeah, you have the dramatics going on, but you always have the fun. You don't- especially with, like, other stories out there, and a lot of games can learn from this, because it shows us, you know? Why does it show us? It shows us you don't want to have a lot of too much drama, and you don't want to have too much comedy. There has to be that balance. But this was comedy gold right here, because when you end up singing the song at the end that is so adorable that's so humble because some companies will be like no i don't want you to end up doing something like that to our theme song but overwatch and blizzard entertainment look what they just did they made their character hum the theme song in his quirky way it's like they're kind of making fun of themselves this was great but junk rap my man it's so great to meet you it is so great to meet you i am glad you are part of the fam now here on miss cat squad but wow i could say somebody's name right correctly this time whoa Whoa! Score one for Cat! Whoa, but yeah, that's what I love about this, because all these characters are so relatable, and his design was so cool. I mean, he has, like, one one leg, and it's like a peg leg type thing, so I love that. He He's, like, he's that type of character where, you know, in movies, when you have, like, the little guy and the big guy, and the little guy's always like, Hey, I'm the boss! I'm the boss here! You know, I'm the boss! I'm the boss! And, you know, he has some kind of complex because he's so short. That's what he kind of reminded me of because he was blaming the big guy. Like, oh, don't mess up. This is your fault. Don't mess up. This is your fault. But, ah, I love this. Thank you guys again for introducing me to Overwatch. Like, ah, oh, I'm loving this so much. And I can't wait to experience everything that Overwatch has to offer. But yeah, guys, you can expect a ton of Overwatch content here on Miss Cat Squad. Don't forget to subscribe if you want more. Don't forget to hit the bell notification if you want notifications. And don't forget to hit the like button. Wait, I just said that wrong. I literally was just so... See, I'm scatterbrained. I said that wrong. But hey, let's keep it in here because it's junk running. But anyway, guys, I hope you have an amazing day. You stay safe out there. And as always, Miss Cuts, until the next video, embrace your fangirl and you're the fanboy every single day. Bye, guys. Hey, squad. Thanks so much for tuning in to this episode of Miss Cat Squad. If you want to follow our adventures outside of YouTube, be sure to check out the description down below for all these awesome, fun links. And if you really love what we're doing on YouTube and want to be part of the journey and to contribute to it, be sure to check out to our Patreon page for awesome monthly awards. Thanks again, squad. And until the next video, embrace your own fangirl and your own fanboy every single day.